to show you a keyboard replacement here on a Dell Inspiron 1521. Now the original keyboard has already been taken out, but I'll show you by putting the new keyboard in exactly how you get the original one out in the first place. Now I'm attaching it with a ribbon cable here, making sure that it's insecure, snapped in tight, and it's straight. And once that's snapped in, make sure it's secure. Now we're not going to be able to get the keyboard in until we take the hinge cover plate off, which we should have done first, but it's okay. The keyboard can just sit there connected while we get this plate off. Dells are easy. If you look right here, you're going to see a little slot there, and that the purpose of that little slot is so you can put something in there and pry up the hinge cover plate. 